Assalamualaikum dear friends, welcome back to my channel Dr. Crochet. Today I am going to show you how to make this beautiful cap. I have used side puff crochet stitch to make this beautiful cap. It's very simple and easy. So let's start how to make this beautiful cap. All we need is a crochet hook. I have used 5.5 mm crochet hook and double ply wool yarn. Here I have used multiple color of yarn and now I am going to use single color yarn to show you how to make this pattern. First of all I am going to make a magic ring. Just turn the yarn and make a loop. Insert hook on the magic ring and make single crochet. Now I'm going to make 12 single crochet in this magic ring. yarn to make the ring tight and insert hook in the first stitch and make a slip stitch to join as we do in uh, working in round now chain 3 and count as one double crochet turn over and insert hook in the same stitch and make one double crochet now make Two double crochet in each of the stitch I have made in this magic ring. As we do while working in round to increase the size, we are going to make two double crochet in each of the single crochet we have made in this magic ring. I have made Two double crochets in each of the single crochet I have made in magic ring. Now we have 24 double crochets. I am going to insert hook in the top of the first double crochet and make a slip stitch to join. Now chain 3 then count as one double crochet and over, insert hook in the next stitch, make one double crochet. Now I'm going to make side puff stitch and to make side puff stitch, yarn over and make one double crochet half instead of making Completing it, I'm leaving loop on the hook and again one half double crochet over the double crochet I have just made. Three times I'm going to make half double crochet as I have to. One, two, three loops of these half double crochet and fourth one is here. I'm going to Pull the hook and this is how it looks side puff stitch now again yarn over and make one double crochet in next stitch and three times half double crochet leaving loop on the hook from the double crochet I have just made three times Half double crochet and make a puff stitch again. Yarn over and make insert hook in next stitch and make one double crochet and make a puff stitch over the double crochet I have just made and again one double crochet. Side up 
single crochet I have just made. Continue working. Stitches. Make one side puff stitch in each of the double crochet I have made in single crochet. stitch in each of these stitches to increase the number of stitches to increase the size of round now instead of increasing I have just to work on the same number of stitches and so I'm going to skip one stitch here with next after this puff stitch and make second stitch one double crochet to form a puff stitch continue working in the same pattern skip one stitch and make one double crochet in next stitch to make a puff stitch continue across Yeah, I 
have completed 8 rows of side cross stitch spacing with 1 row of single crochet now it's time to make border for making border I am going to use 4 mm crochet hook color of yarn to make it different from the whole pattern so it's up to you you can use the same color yarn or contrast color or any color of your choice so so insert hook from any of the chain make one single crochet then make one single crochet in each of the stitch using 4 millimeter crochet hook to make it to make it little bit tight instead of here from the back loop only and drag the yarn make one single crochet insert hook from the back of loop and make one single crochet this is back loop single crochet so I'm going to make back loop single crochet for next 5 rows for making 1 inch over here I have made it with the same color yarn I have used for making border so insert hook from back to side and drag the yarn over here color of yarn or single color of yarn it's up to you i hope you like my video so if you like my video please like and share my video and keep watching stay tuned goodbye nice day.